I fall into the habit of trying to find the latest and greatest lot or palette. And while we may strike gold, it's not always about getting the best deal possible. Hello? I don't know what that charge for $10,000 is. I saw a comment on Facebook the other day that said your first pallet purchase should be an investment to the potential relationship. And that really stuck with me. With that being said, we just purchased a lot from 88 lots. Wish us luck. Jacking unboxing. I thought he was gonna say palletjacking.com. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to palletjacking.com to go order from us. Right. <laughs> what is up, beautiful people? TJ and April here. Uh, we've been on a very long hiatus. I don't yeah. know how long ago it's been. It's feel like it's been months, but it's only probably been two weeks. Yeah. It probably ain't even been two weeks, but it feel like it's been that long. Yeah. <laughs> we are back with an unboxing video. We have a very exciting uh, unboxing before. We've wanted to order from this place uh, for a couple of weeks now. We finally got around to ordering from them. It is 888 lots. And um, so we'll give you the specifications of it. So the way we're gonna do this video is a little bit differently. Um, we're gonna go through um the boxes and we'll pull out as much as we can and then we'll show you everything you'll see it you know on the screen and then we'll flip over to the um my house and we'll go through and list some stuff um but you know you'll see it you'll right. see how to get at, at the end of it we're going to tell each box how much we expect to make from each individual box and i think it's going to be a uh, four videos so right because it's what four boxes it's right? four boxes four so boxes. so you'll know at the end of this video how much money we expect to make from that one box Hopefully, <laughs> with the magic of movie making. Right. So let's get the box. Oh, hold on. Let's tell you how much it is. Okay, so we pay what two forty eight for the box for the whole thing. It's yep. four boxes, and we pay forty eight dollars for shipping. So it's like two ninety six. Two ninety six like, total. Total. And there's allegedly three hundred and eighty two. Eighty two items in it. Okay. Yep. And so that brings us to thirty nine cents per item. Right. So, we, <laughs> so even if everything in these boxes is like a dollar junk, yeah, that still will still be able to double our money, right? right. Theoretically, right. or close close to double our money. So, um, hopefully, we can send most <laughs> of the stuff to Amazon. We can get some Amazon inventory. I know uh, some people kind of with liquidation to Amazon, they don't mm -hmm. necessarily want to send liquidation items to Amazon. But these are brand new items. Okay. Uh, never opened. Never used. Um, and actually, 888 actually will provide whatever they need to Amazon if there were ever anything to come. That's one of the good things about ordering from Amazon, uh, 888 lights is because they're really wholesale sellers. Um, okay. So, anyway, without further ado, let's get the box. All right. Okay, one thing uh -huh. that we didn't mention is allegedly the MSRP is six thousand six thousand three hundred ninety four and seventy eight cent. Yeah. So <laughs> That's the MSRP, so that's what the manufacturer wants. But it does, the, the good thing about 88 Locks is that they also tell you what the estimated Amazon selling price is, and I think they do it through some kind of computer generation whenever they build the boxes. Okay. So, if we listed everything on Amazon, everything was able to go onto Amazon, we should make um, $5,648.94, which is a lot. Okay, so we'll see, <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah we'll, see. we'll see how that goes. All right. This is, I don't know what this is. This is an iPhone or iPad mini uh, case. So it is, you can't really see too much of it. There's an iPad mini case. Here is a, it's a case for probably 
another iPad or just for a tablet. It's safe for a tablet. So it's a bigger, it's a larger yeah. one. You don't see that. And there. Like I said, at the end of the video, we'll pull it up and show you how much this stuff is because it will take too long to just kind of do everything. This is a laptop sleeve uh, for 11.6 inch um, Acer um, laptop. So it's like in a golden color. It's pretty nice. All right, and here is a military duty case with stamp for iPad 2, 3, and 4. So what I am noticing, everything does appear to be in new condition, so that's great. Uh, this is seems like another uh, sleeve. I don't want to really take it. I guess I can take it out. Make sure I put it back in there. So this is it's like a little sleeve. Uh, okay. It's got like a little cover for the... Hey, what's that? Shit, like a peak. Yeah. <laughs> but it's got a little okay. cover for your... If you just got a... Um, Screen protector. All right, here is. It's like a, <laughs> it's a wireless uh, charger. Something. Oh, is that what it is? Mm -hmm. Because it sure don't say it on here. Mm -hmm. I can see it by the phone. Oh, it's from on. IKEA. Okay, it's like a little cute little thing. Yeah. All right. And we have a Samsung Galaxy Tab 4 um, slim folding case in the color of pink. So this is just a regular case that you can set up and look at. I'm going to put that back. Alright, here we have a phone case, iPhone. 7 plus or 6s plus it's pink it's just a random this is another ipad mini case it's like purple polka dots um this is some kind of it's a case for something. I'm sure it's for a tablet a, yeah, or a laptop, a laptop or, something. or something like that. Anyway, that's what it looked like. It's like a little turquoise, like a briefcase. Yeah. It's nice though. I mean, I think somebody will buy that. Hopefully the goal is to send most of the stuff into Amazon. That's the goal. All right, so this is, I'm not sure what this is. I'm not gonna lie to you until you, I know what it is, but it's some sort of a screen. It goes, it goes to something. It's got like a circuit board on the back, so I'm not sure, exactly, <laughs> not sure what this is. So, uh, they also do provide a manifest, so, you know, we can kind of pull up everything. All right, here's a mini wireless keyboard with touchpad for, um, I guess it's for your Windows or Apple or I guess just any kind of it's like a computer little... system to use, yeah. Okay. All right, we've got another laptop MacBook soft skin case. Uh, it's like a pink, pink color, and this is for the 13 inch MacBook. I've I haven't got one of these before. This is a Kevlar Kevlar. Um, Fiber case for iPhone 10 glossy black. Can't see nothing. It's just, it's it's just a, a it's black, inside of a case. It's just a, yeah. <laughs> uh, this may be another wireless charger, maybe, or there's something. It's got some stuff in there. Let's see what this is. I don't know what that is. I don't know what it is. <laughs> so I'm going to show you guys, and maybe you guys can tell us what this is. Right. And this, whatever this is. I like a glow. Yeah. Or I like a basketball. I don't know what that is. <laughs> well, there you have it. It's new, but I don't know what it does. We've got another uh, wireless thing. Yeah. I'm going to have to keep one of them. I like those. 
Uh, we've got another case here as well. This is a, a leather uh, flip case. It doesn't have, um, it's not open. I mean, it's it's, op it's unopened, so I'm not gonna open it. That's what that is. This is some stuff that I don't know what it is. <laughs> <laughs> some randomness. Okay, I'm gonna take it out. I'm not gonna take it out. Okay, this is what it is. See that what it is. What is that? Look like it's going on. Oh, know. those are um. Cable. Yeah. It goes for it's something for your cable. Yeah, you put it's a coax, coax cable. What he said. What he said. Yep. Yeah. Got a whole thing. Going. Quick, quick connect for co coax cable. Okay. Say it three times fast. <laughs> All right, we got a e e candy. Box. Got people on them. Make sure we see recording. I have no idea what it is. Let's open it up. Oh, some headphones. Okay. Let me move that back so you guys can see it. Cause. All right. Okay, we got a bunch of extra or the same stuff. So I'm just gonna pull them out so you can see them. Got a million of those. Yep. So these are uh, tempered glass screen protectors, two pack for iPhone 5, 5S, 5C, and F S E. So we got a whole slew, slew of those. The yep. good thing about these is that they have hard cases, so yeah. they shouldn't be in a break whenever we hopefully we can send these in. That's yeah. the, the goal. All right, we got a USB car charging. Pink. Pull me something big next. Yeah. This is a stylish and transparent mini desktop shredder. Oh, okay. Perfect for light duty shredding. Here's a Scorpion car stereo installation mountain dash kit. That's what it looks like. That's all the stuff that goes in it. I don't know what this is. It's a brown box. I'm gonna open it because it's not sealed. It is sealed. I don't know what this is, but it looks expensive. It looks like one of them. Oh, it's, a, it's a laptop battery. Oh, okay. All right, so this is a laptop battery, and it's sealed. Which is good. It doesn't say what kind of type, but it is a laptop battery. Alright, let's see what this does. Dig down in there. Here's a hot TV box. Uh this box is a little dusty. A little dusty. <laughs> let's look at it. I'm gonna open it up so we can see what it is actually. Yeah. Uh I don't know. Maybe you guys can figure it out. This one keyboard's in it. Well, maybe. Oh no, it ain't. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I'm gonna look at the instructions here. Okay. Y'all just never mind me. So this is another one of the wireless chargers. So we got three of those so far. All right, we've got a Bluetooth, um, Bluetooth 4.1 earphones, earbuds, whatever they are. Blue Dio, blue, blue Ideo. Okay. I keep pulling out random crap that I don't know what it is. I try to pull out the stuff that I kind of know what it looked like. So, <laughs> here's some wires. Uh, maybe phone, internet. I don't know what that look like. Um, I don't know. Here you go. They're brand new, whatever they are. And then we've got a five watt USB power adapter. Just an Apple, um, just a power brick. And it's sealed. That's good. Look, I'm gonna pull out something that I can identify. I can yeah, I'm gonna pull something. Here we go. I got a phone case, guys. <laughs> iPhone 6 or 6. You know what? 6S. I gotta say it real slow. <laughs> I'm 
I'm pulling out something else big. Well, I got something small first. This is a pair, this is a pack of uh, eight inch black cable ties. So tie wraps, what we call them. Cable ties. And then this is a MacBook Pro 15 inch laptop bag. That's nice. Black. Uh, po Folk. Po Foco. Here's a uh, leather folio case for Acer tablet. No. I'm about to throw it on mm -hmm. the floor. So we're gonna take a break real quick. Let's jump over to the computer and we're gonna list a few of these items. All right, so we're gonna go over box number one. I'm not gonna look at everything within the box. It will take an immense amount of time. Uh, so what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna pull a couple of items, uh, show me looking them up on the computer. Um, and then I will just kind of go through some of these items and see what we would price them for. Um, you know, whether it's gonna be something locally or there's gonna be something on eBay or Amazon. Uh, so I'll tell you all that. So let's get into the computer and we will see exactly what we think we're going to get. All right. So on the left hand side of the screen, uh, I've got the manifest from 888 lots on the right hand side of the screen. I have my Chrome tab open with inventory lab. I have Amazon, I have Google and I have a, uh, eBay tab and I also have my inventory tool that I use to kind of organize uh, things. Don't mind how it looks because I didn't do any formatting on it, but that's, you know, it is what it is. All right, so let's just go ahead and start with something. Um, so this is the uh, Bonsai Transparent Mini Desktop Shredder. Um, I don't remember looking this up, but I'm gonna look it up again. Um, so if you look at the, if you look at, the manifest it is on the manifest uh i don't believe i found it on amazon though but i will look and try and see so i did not find it on amazon so what i'll do is i'll just copy uh the header or the the name of it and then i'll put that in the search bar and see if i can find it that way if i can't find it that way um i will just do a google search for the name so that's one of the problems with buying these like amazon returns is that you have a lot of chinese um private labeled items so their item says made in chinese so in or china so this item this shredder will be made in china you can get it from aliexpress alibaba any of those china sites where they manufacture those and then it just won't have this name on it, it won't say bonsai on it but you can put your name on there so if i want it to be pallet jacking i can put pallet jacking on here and it's the same exact thing and that's how they sell that stuff uh on amazon i've done private labeling before um you know it just it, it takes a lot of work to do that because you have to always continuously find trending trendy products um so like this is probably was a product that was on like facebook marketplace ad and something like that and a whole bunch of people bought it um but it's just not probably not trendy anymore so it's probably why it's not on here but it's currently unavailable uh it has four stars 116 ratings and uh it's not discontinued however it is not available um and it has not had a purchase for quite a while um i think the last one looks like it's like 2018 was the last purchase but it's got pretty good reviews on it so it must work well um so what i would do with this is i'm just going to copy that bonsai c17 whatever it is b so what i can do is i can either list this on amazon and just put a price in or i can list it on ebay if they have it on ebay i would rather list it on ebay um since it's not available so i do not see it on ebay um so what i'm going to do is i'm going to this is my third thing that i would try to do so i'm gonna go over here and see if i can find a desktop style cross cut paper shredder just anyone in general on ebay because what i'll do is i'll put this one on there and i will price it around uh what those other ones are priced for all right so they got these uh mini cross style cross cut um you know they range very very widely but I'm seeing about $25. I think I think somebody will pay probably for this. Uh, I think 
that people will pay at least $15 for this. So I'm gonna list this for 15 bucks. I'm gonna put that on the list as $15. I already went through some stuff in the box, some little small stuff, some phone cases. Um, so phone cases, I'm not gonna go through and price the phone cases because the phone cases are gonna be probably done in store and they're probably gonna be, you know, $5. Some of the older style phone cases like the iPhone 5 and 6 and 7, I will list those on eBay because those do sell on eBay because people do still have those phones. Um, but some of the other ones I'm not gonna list, like some of the Samsung phones, I'm just not gonna list online. It's not gonna be worth the time to list it there. Um, I put them in the store and eventually they'll get sold. Uh, so I wanna see this battery. This is a, uh, a ZTE um, little, if you can see that. It's a ZTE little battery. I'm not sure exactly what it's for. Um, but I'm gonna type it in just the, the model number and see if I can find it. So I am on a MacBook, well not a MacBook, I'm on a iMac uh, computer and it it's a little bit different because you don't have Excel, you have numbers. So I kind of have to work through getting, uh, you know, getting this to work as good as I want it to. All right, so this is a replacement battery. It doesn't really have a model number that I can tell. Oh, yeah, it does. So I'm seeing them around uh, $35 on here. So let me go to eBay and see if I can find it on eBay. Okay, here we go. So these are selling for on eBay for about 8, 10, 14, 99, 11, 99, that's for two. Um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and say, we could probably sell this for about $8 online. It is ship first class is fairly small. Um, so we're just gonna say eight bucks on that. I'm gonna spend a lot of time looking. $8 on eBay. Um, this is just a MacBook case. We're just gonna say five dollars in store on that. That will sell pretty good in the store. They wanna look this up. So this was like a a little briefcase kind of thing. Um, looks pretty high quality. I mean, it's it is a Chinese made one, but it doesn't look bad. Um, I don't know how I'm gonna look this up because it does not have a tag on it that I can see. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and open it. Trying to find a brand name, and I think I found one here. Is that like ASMR? <laughs> uh, I don't see if I can find it. I think I can find it with this name. So I'm probably not going to be able to find it online. Uh, but I think somebody would like this little, um, this like a little cute little laptop bag. Uh, I'm just going to put it for five dollars in store five bucks all right this is a another little laptop sleeve let me see if i can find this one i don't think i i think i looked it up already and i couldn't find it um so like i said i'm not going to spend too much time trying to find all this stuff i'm um, just going to price it and move on so we had a couple of these i'm not sure if this is the exact one but i'm typing in just to see if this is it Oh, it is it. All right, so this is going for about, um, these range from $40 to $16. That's Amazon basic $16. Actually, I have one of these uh, bags. But like I said, this is a Chinese made one. So I'm probably going to list it on uh, eBay for about 16, maybe $16, something like that. $18, we're gonna say, let's say $18. I think we can get $18 out of that. All right, this is a protective sleeve for a tablet. It doesn't say which type of tablet. It's purple, oh, iPad Pro 12.9. So these go for about $20. Um, it's brand new, still in the package, it is leather, it's purple. 
Um, I think somebody will buy this for $20. Let's put 20 down. And then we may sell this like, this may be something that we sell locally or in the store for maybe 15 or $10, but I'm gonna put 20. Um, Cause I think I can get that online. I think I can get a 20 plus shipping. Um, so this is a MacBook soft case. We only sell these for about five bucks in store. Um, most time it's not worth it. List them and I'm gonna go through these last four items. Then we're gonna jump back over to the unboxing. So these are as for these same things. These are from Ikea. Uh, they are some kind of little um, charging stations. I guess you can just plug them in and set your phone on top of them. So let's look at this up. Um, we'll look it up on Amazon first, but I know, I don't think this is gonna be on Amazon. So they don't have this exact one, but they have one that looks very, very similar to it. And it's uh, showing for $41. I don't think that uh, anybody's gonna pay $41 for this unless they're specifically looking for this exact one. Um, and I don't see a listing for it. I probably can do some more research uh, and find a listing for it. But I'm gonna look on Amazon just to see if I can find one that is similar, or eBay. I'm looking on eBay to see if I can find one uh, similar and I did find the same ones. Um, there's a couple of them for about 20. They range from about 25 to 28. That's 14 U's. So I think we could probably get, um, I'm just gonna say $20 in a, a brand new condition. I think we should be able to get $20 a piece for these. We have four of them. So we'll get those listed for $20 a piece. So I'll say 20, 20. And I think that'd be 20 after fees and shipping because they're, Really going for about $25. Um, that'll be, that won't be, you know, five to seven dollars to ship that. All right, so that's four of these for $20. So let's jump back over to the unboxing. What is that? Pop pocket? Yeah, and then another Apple um, power brick. All right, here we got a, a classic buckle watch band. It's for an Apple Watch. There you go. What is it? Oh, okay. A watch band. Yep. Yeah. And we have a... Um, it's a cell phone case, but I don't... I can't tell which... I don't know um, what kind of phone it's for, but there you go. I have... I grabbed a couple of items. It's like a football, but it's not a football. So this is a case for some headphones. We um, sold a couple of these. These covers, these uh bolts. Oh yeah. Uh, phone cases. Those sell pretty good mm -hmm. on um, eBay. eBay. Yeah. yeah. Here's a random remote. It's random, ain't it? <laughs> uh, we've got a case. This is for a. What is this for? Mark Jacobs. This is Mark Jacobs. Mark Jacobs. This is a Mark Jacobs case for an iPhone. Here we have uh, some white wall plates. Let's see. Then we have a um, look like an adapter for a dryer or washing machine or something like that. We're almost done with this box. Yeah. I don't know what this is. It's missing something. It is missing something, ain't it? It's I a, felt like it may have fallen out at the bottom of the bag. Yeah. Because it's kind of... Singularity uh, computers, I guess, or something. I'm just like slashing through the thing as you're I talking. I see. <laughs> uh, I don't know what that is. I don't whatever know. Whatever it is, missing one other thing. It is. So maybe we'll find whatever that is, but I have no idea what this is for. Uh-uh. Um, we got another iPhone 6S case with a little stylus. I'll show you a couple things. I got a TV wall mount. 
Uh, like for small TVs, like maybe it's like an ultra slim, it's very tiny. I've never seen one this small before. Yeah, me either. <laughs> it's, it's, it's for a 13 inch to 27 inch. So we got a 22 inch monitor, it worked for it. I, I wouldn't trust it. <laughs> the thing will fly on the floor. Yeah. All right, here's a cell phone case. I don't know what it's for, it's just random. Doesn't have any. Nothing. Nope. All right, we've got a micro USB uh, travel charger. And another purple um, case. All right, we got an iPhone 6 Plus heavy duty shockproof case. What's this? Oh, 6 Plus. Yep. Okay. And a, what is this? This is for an Apple Watch. It's the cover. The for cover, it. yeah. The case. See that? Maybe not. I'm just gonna move it. Yeah. All right. So we've got a new laptop battery for Dell Inspiron 1520, and we've got a whole bunch of other models. Let's just say laptop battery, and it is sealed. It's new. Uh, what is this? This is some sort of case. For some kind of tablet. Tablet case, I understand. Yeah. See, we've got a Spigen. This is my favorite phone case, the Spigen brand. Uh, Galaxy Note 7. And we got another case for a, this is a Kate Spade New York. These are like designer cases. Uh, iPhone 6 and iPhone 6S. Let's check it out. You can see it. Kate Spade. All right, here is a nifty nook. Nifty nook. This must be from some kind of little phone or yeah. a, a, a book tablet. Yeah. Some kind of book tablet. All right, this is a. I don't know what this is. This is a cell phone clip, a lazy clip holder mount, flexible something. So it's pink. And wipes, and it's just like a phone clip. You can clip it onto like a desk or something like that, and then uh, clip, clip your phone on the end of it and use that. All right, here's a selfie stick. All right, and I have a package of USB um, micro USB cables. Just a pack of cables and it comes with like a little uh, bag to put all the cables in. Here's an iPhone 7 case. You can't see it, but it's in there. <laughs> there you have it. All right, this is another Kate Spade iPhone 6 uh, case. Uh, this is an iPod iPod? No, what is this? This is just a case, ain't it? I think it's an iPod. Is it? Nano? No, it ain't an iPod Nano. It ain't in here. Uh-uh. Hybrid shell. So it's, it's a, a shell. Yes, yeah, it's a shell case. Now, I don't think people use iPod Nanos anymore. But yeah, but... Maybe yeah. somebody buy it. I don't know. Here you go. We have one. <laughs> this is a two-pack, six-foot um, USB or lightning cables uh, for iPhone. Heavy-duty style. Let me take that home. Here's a, a Vivo Fit Fitness Man paid by Garmin. If you can see such things. All right, we've got a couple of Apple um, iPhone 6X Plus um, earbuds. We've got a black pair and a white pair. I don't think these are official Apple. They may be, I don't know. Tell. Yeah, but they're just, just earbuds and they've got the 3.5 millimeter um, decker on them. Here's an ET pocket. It's a phone charger for your car. All right, so this is a Samsung remote control. It's like a little small remote, but it's a Samsung brand remote. And then I've got a some sort of a folio case. It's uh, like turquoise and got like this little fun pattern on it. 
Um, it has a zipper on it, so I guess you can put like your stuff into it. You can I carry around as a purse, plus put your phone in it. Uh, this uh, this appears to be an HDMI cable. Okay, this is the one I need. No, I'm kidding. Huh? <laughs> is this the one I need? I don't know. Look at it. I don't know. It's just a regular one. Yeah. All right, we've got a Samsung Galaxy Note 5, uh, the stylus pen. Here's a Samsung something. Wireless charging pad. Okay. Let's see, we have a lithium ion uh, ZTE battery for um, a Concord 2. I don't know what that is. All right, so we got the ZTE battery. It's a, a list, lit, lithium, lithium ion battery. You can see that. All right, and then here is, a, what is this? Raspberry case. Raspberry Pi. Yeah. Pi. Okay. Yeah. That. That right though. Oh, you can't see that. There we go. Maybe that's about them. Okay. Then I've got a Netgear um, power uh, adapter. I mean, just like start back. All right, so I got everything tallied up. Um, you see the table's pretty clear. A couple things I want to show you highlights inside. I always like showing you the highlights inside the box. So I did find this uh, Garmin um, activity tracker. It's going for uh, about $40 online. I think I can probably get at least 30 for it. Um, the last one sold was 35. So I think I can probably list it for 30 and get it sold pretty quickly. That's what I'm trying to do. And then also, this, I don't know if it's gonna work when I pull it up, but it's like a little hologram basketball or baseball. I think it's a basketball, I can't tell. Anyway, you can change the colors on it. Um, different stuff like that. I didn't pull the, so this part right here will actually be clear. I'm gonna put a picture of it on the screen now, but you're supposed to take, it's got like some, this uh, paper on it that you're supposed to take off. So I left that on. Um, because I'm going to try to sell it. But this right here actually goes for about $15. Um, it's actually pretty cool. Uh, I've seen these before and I've never actually seen one in person. So I thought that was pretty neat. All right. So all in all with this palette, uh, I went through and I counted every item that was inside of this box. Uh, I believe this box had 128 items in it. It may have been 130. Um, There's a couple things I took out for myself. I took out um, this SD card. I can use that as a 64 gig sd card and i took out something else and i can't find it it's i took out some cables somewhere i don't know where they at anyway so it's probably 130 items in this so i base everything very conservatively um and i think some of the dollar stuff we probably won't necessarily sell quickly but i think over time they will sell um, we have dollar bins inside of our stores a wooden big bin that we built um, we just put like a lot of stuff in it that's a dollar and normally people go through and they rummage through and they find they pick out five or ten items uh, out of them. So I priced a lot of items at a dollar uh, and with that it is six hundred and fifty six dollars um, even. So six fifty six for this box, which is actually a pretty good start, especially since we only paid two hundred ninety eight dollars for it. Um, that's over double what we uh, what we paid for it on the first box. So some of the stuff is going to be a little bit of a hard sell. Um, so some of the phone cases, there's like an iPhone 5C or um, iPhone 6. Those sell a lot slower. They do sell, they just sell a lot slower. So we may have to sit on for a little bit. Um, but anyway, $656 is what we expect to make out of box number one. So that is going to be it for today, guys. I really appreciate you guys for watching. If you like these types of videos, please like, share, and subscribe. Really appreciate it. Also hit that bell icon, send you notifications whenever we release new videos. I know this is a little bit longer video. Um, but we want to show you uh, each and every little piece. So hopefully we'll try to tweak that a little bit so it won't be as long next time. It probably will be. I don't know. Whatever. See you guys on the next one. Peace. I wish I was above the center of attention, but I'm not. I wish I didn't have to give in to the pressure.